Hello everyone, this is Crota giving you a shoutcast between. Um, it's going to be yellow versus green. This is a 2v2 matchup on Twisted Metal. We have AAA Monstu, AAA Vince against Sur Surrey and Cast. I'll probably just re refer to them as their color and their corresponding race as it's going to be a little bit difficult for me to go ahead and try to keep track of everything that's happening. Here we have Surrey spawning on the top left hand corner, the undead, green spawning on the northern positions, and Cast being the Night Elf player. Meanwhile, we have Night Elf from Vince and Human coming from Monsu. So we have a quick Altar of Kings build. So we're going to have that alt and the Archmage come out a little bit earlier than the typical two minute mark if that farm gets up and up and running fairly soon so we have archmage being produced we have we're gonna have footman and most likely the archmage is gonna go over here and creep out this goblin observatory very early meanwhile we have an altar of elders being produced moonwell is being produced no ancient of war yet so it's either gonna be a tech or it is going to be a hunt a mass huntresses let's see if it's gonna be priestess of the moon no a demon hunter so perhaps just a late tech with an ancient of war later on we do have a death knight coming out and we do have an, a demon hunter coming out as well from the green team uh, the archmage is already nearing halfway completion we do have a speed building of the last farm and we have a speed building of the barracks so we are and monster is trying to get footman as quickly as possible to try to go ahead and take on that creep camp and now this this map is very good for creeping but it is a little bit smaller since this is a 2v2 map we do have a whisk coming across and we do have a whisk coming across as well from from night elf so night elf is going to go ahead and build finally build their ancient of war let's see if an ancient of war is coming down yes no a huntress hall so we are going to be having huntresses coming out from from this side as well from um vince meanwhile we have the archmage who already dropped the water elemental coming in with four five six seven militia very nicely done the militia being uh, coming in a little bit late so that militia is is going to go ahead and be ensnared by the trappers as opposed to the water elemental the water elemental taking a lot of damage Let's go. I, mean, I want to make sure that no units are going to go down. It looks like we, we may lose one militia if he's not careful. Yes, we do. He did lose one militia. Nice Tome of Experience for the Archmage. So Archmage already sitting at level 2 before this um, creep camp is cleared. It's gonna, almost going to be level 3. It looks as though another militia is going to go down. Now we have ghouls coming in and Sir Ray is going to go ahead and try to take down. And the Death Knight's going to come in. So the Death Knight, this is going to be a problem. So we are going to have units being lost left and right. We do have the finally taking out. So the Archmage is almost level 3 if he's able to take out some of those of units we have the demon hunter coming in as well so the demon hunter and the death knight already coming in doing a very good job of this harass now we have vince's demon hunter coming in as well a nice crisscross of the mana burn and we have red versus green here coming across we do have um what water elemental is being coming out it looks as though a nice another mana burn on the on the death knight death knight down to no mana demon hunter and uh, the green demon hunter is down to 109 we have a couple more dispels and it looks as though the demon hunters are going to go ahead and go down. It looks like we were, and the yellow team was able to go ahead and push back this attack. So AAA able to push back this attack. And cast his demon hunters now taking some damage. And the ghoul is taking damage as well. Archmage only needs one more kill to be able to get to level 2. Or level 3 and get level 2 water elemental. So that is going to be a... Um, as soon as that happens, those ghouls are going to very, have a very, very hard time trying to do any pressing. It looks as though the Archmage notices this. And is going to go ahead and try to creep out this null camp to get level 3 very quickly. Meanwhile, we have demon hunters tracing across each other on the map. And now we have yellow huntresses doing some nice job of padding against the cast. Cast is now forced to try to run to the back of the base. He picks up a boot to speed, but now is oh, almost gets stuck. That huntress is, has not fired a single hit yet. Don't know what's happening there, but it looks as though the green's demon hunter is going to be able to use those moon wells, get back up to 575 hit points fairly quickly. And or... No, only two Moonwells, so only back up to about 400 hit points. And it looks as though the Demon Hunter and the Archmage is currently sitting at level 3. is going to go ahead and try to do some damage. Here we have the... And it looks as though those, those uh, Wisps are now taking some damage as well. Trying to repair some Moonwells. One, two Wisps and one detonated and one down on hit points. If he's not careful, um, Demon Hunter is trying to get in some extra damage in there. We get another Mana Burn, but the Mana Burn is not really doing too much damage at all. We have... And that uh, Moonwell looks like it is going to go down quickly, even though Cast is trying to repair it with some Wisp, and the Wisp does go down as well. So, and um, Cast taking some major damage. Meanwhile, it looks as though um, I do not see where where the the Death Knight is at this time. I'm oh, the Death Knight is now trying to go ahead and ha has been harassing uh, Monsu's base. So both teams trying to do some nice harass. Um, it's very hard to see with these colors, unfortunately. And once you was able to harass and force a teleportation back, and then and Vince Yellow is also going to go ahead and teleport back. Wow, that was a very long, 
Archmage attack animation. That was... Where did that attack come from? Wow. Um, I wish I was able to track that a little bit better. I hope that Cass's Wisps is going to go ahead and try to um, try to run away. It looks as though uh, the Archmage is going to be able to go ahead and take it out. He's going to be very ghostly if he picks up a, 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 a Zeppelin and then flies away, but it looks as though he doesn't. Um, Archmage is, does not have a Squirrel of Town Portal, so it does have to be careful. We have Demon Hunters and Huntresses now trying to fight in the middle of the map. And it looks as though um, both still Tree of Life right now, so I'm... Unfortunately, I don't see if, if gold's being transferred, but it, this may be a feed strategy into the human and undead armies. And let's take a look. We do have halls of the dead being teched and keep being teched. Meanwhile, we do have, oh, it's still at, no, currently at Tree of Ages. So um, Tree of Ages for yellow while we're still at Tree of Life for green. And Demon Hunter is now, Demon Hunter with Huntress is trying to come around. Demon Hunter and um, Green's Demon Hunter is still only at level 1 and hasn't done that much damage. Meanwhile, um, Green's Death Knight is going to go ahead and already sitting at level 2 with a Ring of Regeneration and still has a Rod of Necromancy. Uh, um, we now have a Naga Sea Witch coming out for Yellow. So Yellow does have a Naga Sea Witch along with his Demon Hunter. Cast is going to go ahead and try to run back to the north. It, it looks like the, both players are just trying to get into position right now. No player is really trying to commit to to a win, both players trying to tech up to the units that they really want or try to get some hero advantage. Huntress is now just running around. Those are the um, yellow, or yeah, Cast is going to go ahead and try to take down these units. I'm going to go ahead and surround that. No, go ahead and go ahead after those no wardens, those no wardens, and taking extra damage from those huntresses. So those huntresses are going to take down those no wardens very quickly. Meanwhile, we have the Archmage now, and if he, if he goes ahead, and, and those are a lot of low hit point and ghouls. Those ghouls got to be careful. If those ghouls have to run to the back of the base, very nicely done, but yellow does not want to overcome it at this point. Archmage does have a good amount of mana, so is able to drop an additional water mental if needed. It quickly goes after a low hit point and ghoul. That ghoul is down to um, what 28 hit points, and now... And Death Knight doing a very good job trying to protect those ghouls. The second arch, second water elemental is out, and oh, that archmage needs to be careful. That archmage is going to get surrounded if he's not careful. It, able to head back out, very nicely done. That archmage able to able to survive if he's going to be able to take down that low hit point ghoul. That ghoul is down to 20 hit points. One more attack, yes, and that ghoul is going to go down. So a very nicely play. We have the um, Demon Hunter of uh, Vince going ahead and trying to get some heals in and we have Archmage now coming in with a Mountain King so Mountain King's going to be able to take off those trailing ghouls you have a third water elemental being dropped down so those water elementals are going to be doing a very good job trying to take down this army but we have a, a nice pincer and those water elementals now trying to take out that demon hunter demon hunter is probably going to try to mana burn that Mountain King Mountain King uh, oh he's this is a very bad position stuck in the two armies but um but the Vince is now able to join in this fight that Mountain King is now going to head and go ahead and go down so that Mountain King goes down but at a cost of a of a huntress so uh, fairly even trade there if if i have to say so right now level one mountain king resurrected 170 while huntresses i believe cost 200 or 190 plus in a, some wood so um, a nice nice trade off here now survey is now trying to take out they're trying to get a surround on that archmage the archmage does not have um does not have a a, a stout scroll town portal but is able to with those water mountains really take out a lot of damage not the sea which is now ooh, get staff of preservation head heads back to the base very nicely done here so now both players just you know trying to get a feel for each other and i don't know if this this attack is really beneficial to anyone and both players trying to do a good job i think i saw a scroll of healing i mean now we have level three on the death knight death knight's currently sitting at level three we have a potion of invulnerability on the archmage very very nicely done but that potion of invulnerability i think was just a lesser invulnerability yes it is just a lesser invulnerability and is going to head go ahead and head ha get surrounded and go down as well Wow, so a very, very bad push coming in from the yellow team, losing both the Archmage and the Mountain King. And it's going to go, oh, Mountain King is back already, but the Mountain King is trying to run away. And we do, we do have a couple of sorceresses out as well, and I'm going to go ahead and pause this replay. Stay tuned for part two of this replay as we have the Mountain King now finally surrounded.